Welcome back to Cactus Court Plays Batman Arkham Asylum. My name is Kevondre. My name is Bobby. Last time, we went into this penitentiary where there's just hella crazy people in there, and then, like, there's, like, setting those motherfuckers free. Yep. Uh, there was uh, Clayface. Yeah, there's Clayface over here who is now Warden Sharp. Yep. Get me out of here! Um, Poison Ivy got set free. Yeah, the inmates got set free. I got uh, this thing. Yep. Which can help a lot. I'm going to be able to get to all sorts of places I couldn't go before. Nice. Um, so it's pretty sweet. And now it's time for some spoops. All the spoops? Well, I think so. Oh, also, Poison Ivy's free. Yeah. That's and, a good sound. Oh, that's okay. I wouldn't mind getting killed by her. Look, of all the people to kill me, that'd be fine. Unless yeah. she, like, sprouted something in me that just killed me slowly from the inside. I don't know that I care for that. Look, I just want her to kill me. I don't want to marry the chick. Is that what marrying is? Yeah. I think it's usually going the other way. Killing you slowly from the inside out? Yeah, that that's marriage. Oh, you know what? You're right. Maybe not exactly the sprouting thing, but, Surprise! you know, the, the same idea. Same concept. Yeah, usually if you're female, you know, it goes that goes I yeah. always thought there was a spark between us. <laughs> well, now there is. Mm. I know, I know, you guys shot. <laughs> Come and get me, bats. I double dare ya. Did I knock you the fuck out just like a little bit ago? Why don't yeah. you just go get a gun and shoot <laughs> A double dog dare. No knock one you and your gun. No one can resist that. That's right. You're not getting that fucking gun, you little piece of shit. But he wants it. And he's, oh. He wants it really bad. It would be it would be conducive to positive mental health. Dick? You're gonna bleed out your burn. <laughs> Punch in the dick. And she said that's not fair, which, you know, Batman doesn't fight fair. Yeah, exactly. We've been over this. Yeah. Just punch all the dudes in the dick. That's what he does. <laughs> that would be a much more interesting movie. That's my purse! <laughs> <laughs> that's my purse! <laughs> God oh. damn it, Donovan! Fuck right off! Fucking Donovan. Oh. Get the gun. Someone else get a gun? I thought there wasn't anybody over here. You fucking asshole. Like it See again, if only Batman would just pick up the gun, this problem would be solved really fast. Instead, he's killing everybody with his fist. Was that Damn. as easy as it looked? Huh. Well, it won't be so easy trying to catch me. She is just all sorts of crazy. And you love it? No. No, I don't. Oh. That's the bad kind of crazy. She might stab you. Still in the bad she, kind of crazy. She'll way. probably stab you. Just in the bad kind of crazy. Like, there's good crazy, then there's bad crazy. Alright. You say so. Like my sister. My sister is bad crazy. Oh, okay. Right? I don't know what this does, but... Oh, it, it's doing a the thing. There it is. Oop. Patient pacification system deactivated. That's a pacification system? Yeah. Damn. Very shocking. Do you think they put it in there just for the puns? Like, yeah. But also maybe not. I'm willing to bet it was just for the puns. Look, I'm willing to believe that. It's It sounds like the reason why we would do it. It is. Ah, there it is. Okay. Where 
am I supposed to be going? Not that way. No, that way is locked. Not that way. Never go that way. Makes no difference. Open the door. Is it this one? Yeah, just do your thing. I need a box. Uh, you cannot get e box. I wonder why you can't get flask. This is a very odd thing. It seems yeah. like Batman's just taking time out to play on his, you know, PSP. Yeah. Come on. There it is. So, what? how exactly does that little thing work? So, like, you just gotta get the control sticks, both control sticks in the right direction. Oh, okay. That sounds frustrating. It's a kit. I can't go that way. Because my thing doesn't go that far. And I don't have my grappling hook. Okay. It, well, it wasn't supposed to be this way anyway. Fuck you. Yeah, see? It was all a jape. It was all a jape. The jape is jape. Oh no, guys! Yeah. Where are other guys? He, uh, he did not care for the cut of your jib. Yeah, I'm not dealing with this bullshit. Just fuck their shit up. Okay, that works. What? Red Hood? Nice. I think. This is like a Joker cell, but... Who would give the Joker crayons? He probably just made it out of his own blood. You don't know. That's a fair point. I really don't know. And I kind of don't want to. Joker's fucking nuts. He's a little nuts. So, uh, best live action Joker. I don't really like any of them. Like, I know most people really like Heath Ledger, and I, I think he's a fine villain... But I don't think he's really the Joker for me. Because I'm comparing to this Joker, which is my favorite overall Joker. Right? Okay. Um, and none of them compare to this. I was really hoping that Jared Leto was going to surprise me. And, you know, I, I still don't think that he's a bad one. But... Well, apparently all of his scenes were cut. Yeah. Except for, like, the most barest amounts. Regardless, oh, the, the kind of character is not what I was looking for. See? Just for the puns. Yeah. Can't reach that. I need an extender. Put your dick in the box. Look, I'd like to help you, but I can't. I'm not gonna cut the cords. Oh, come on. Just do it. It's okay. They're gonna, like, die. Do you lose if they die? I think so. Shit. Fucking mouth. I could sit here and watch you all. Alright, so this one is over here. Where can I get me one of those? Um, uh, eBay. Yeah. Was it? No, not even a little. Net. Bye bye. Bye bye. Nice. Um. Do what now? Oh, security gate. This is somewhat tedious. Okay. Get out of there, it's gonna blow. Yeah. Get out. Move it! Get out of here! Now! 
Yeah, but then you have like the first we Joker. Die in there. You're safe oh, now. Never mind. You going Funny. after that crazy witch? I saw her heading out of the door as we got out of the room. She won't get away. I'll stop her and then her boyfriend. Good. Listen, I'll go try and get the ventilation system working. If you find her, don't go easy on her. From me. All right. I hope the socks do well. <laughs> yeah. But the first one, with, back with that Adam Caesar West, Romero. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't even shave his mustache off. It was, That's. It was kind of great. That's not what I was looking for. He was good and crazy. I mean, some of the scenarios I thought of. Okay, it was a bit goofy, but still. Yeah. He had a uh, Jack Nicholson. Who went like? He battle. had he had the right idea, but I don't think that it that it was a good casting. Agreed. Patient evaluation one. Huh? Patient name is Victor Zaz. Diagnosed clinically insane after the murder of at least twenty women in the Gotham area. You okay? Hello, Victor. I'm Dr. Cassidy. Seeing as this is our first session, let's spend some time getting to know each other. I don't need to know you, Miss Cassidy. Everything. Don't you think that's a very negative outlook on life, Victor? You've no doubt read my file. Yes, yes I have. It says you come from a wealthy family, that your parents died, and how you lost all the money gambling. And none of it matters. Why do you keep saying that, Victor? Because the only thing that does matter is the mark. Have you seen my work, Miss Cassidy? If you're referring to the marks on your... Of course I mean. Is it on your tally whacker? Yeah. Nice. He's gonna whack her. And then mark it on his tally. Exactly. Tally Zora Naraya Voss Normandy. You know what I'm saying? Yes. I'm glad. Yeah, Cesar Romero, who was great. Jack Nicholson, right idea, wrong casting. Yeah. Heath Ledger, great casting, not a great idea. Yeah. He just, like, I don't know. He just wasn't right for me. But I agree with you that he was a great villain. Yeah. I mean, Two-Face was still the better villain in the movie. They should have really should have given him more focus. Yeah. And I, I feel like he had pretty good focus, but Joker just kind of took away from it. Yeah. Oh, I see. Yes, I see. Do you? Yeah. Oh, okay. Your head explode. Well, that's what heads do. Is it? Yeah, and then Jared Leto, who's... I really don't like the look of him. I, I, don't, I don't like the look of him. I don't really hate the way that he plays the character, but... I, I mean, Jared Leto is a good actor. I know he can act very much however much you want him to. Yeah. I'm thinking this is more of like a very much directional fault. I agree. Like, oh, he's going to be just like a drug lord, crime kingpin kind of person. Yeah. It's like, no. Could, could you not? Not like that? They're going to. Yeah, they are. What's up? Yeah. But I might have to give it to Cesar Romero. Yes. I mean, it's, it's good. Yeah, I understand. You're a crazy bitch. And also the mustache. He's a joker, but with a mustache. Where is she? She scream. And a mustache makes everything better. That is true. I have heard that before. And this one here? Yeah. Why'd you chuck it all the way up there, Batman? Come on, keep up! You getting tired? Let me give you a little help. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Yeah, I don't know either. Viagra, maybe? Oh, she opened the door. Oh. oh nice. Then I got on the floor. Now I'm gonna walk the dinosaur. That's nice. A whole bunch of people have been on the dinosaur show back from back where we were kids. Yeah. Like, Tim Curry was on it, apparently. Didn't know that shit. I'm not surprised. 
I don't care for this. This fucking skeleton. What about favorite live action Batman? Favorite live action Batman. <laughs> That's a hard one too. Like. Because mm. I mean, Christian Bale did a fine job. He, I see. <laughs> see what you've done? Yeah, I was distracting oh, you. Oh, it's 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 Batfleck. Sorry. Batfleck. Yeah, easily, easily Batfleck. Okay. Victor is not responding well to treatment. Victor, yesterday we spoke about the people you killed. Ah, the zombies. They are all people, Victor. They are zombies. Continually <laughs> shuffling through the daily grind, waiting for someone to liberate them. You mean kill them? The police report states that you murdered, or liberated, if you like, 20 young women in the last three months. Each had her throat slit and was left posed. They were all lucky to be chosen to receive my gift. I doubt they would agree with you. Really? How about you, Miss Cassidy? As you take the elevator to your apartment each night, open six locks to apartment 433, remember you forgot to buy your cat food. Again, how do you know where I sit down in your favorite red chair, cat on lap, just waiting for something to happen? I can make it happen, Sarah. I am your salvation. Victor's ass is a spooky motherfucker. Yeah, he can be. Um. I don't like that guy. Now you haven't seen the new Justice League movie. I still haven't seen Justice League. But based off of uh, Batman vs. Superman, easily Batfleck. I think he's got... Ah! <laughs> this motherfucker... Is that it? Okay. He fucking just rolled up on me all smooth and punched me in the jeans. It was great. Jesus. Dicks. I love your scared noises that you make. <laughs> it's just why we shouldn't play horror games. Oh, we gotta. We got you now. You get to. That's fine. You can still jump. Yes. It's like whenever I watch, like, fucking theory videos about, like, uh, horror games. Like, I'll just kind of have it minimized, like, very small window on the side. So I could just kind of look at it from the side of my eye. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be great. Yeah. And that's why you didn't finish Duck Duck Literature Club, is it? Nope. I probably could at this point. I'm so, like, used to everything about it now that I probably could. Oh. But I'm probably not gonna. Oh, okay. What? That's just there? Hello. Yeah. There it is. Alright. I don't think there's anything in this one. Right what? Okay, Batman. <laughs> GG. That, uh, I don't think that worked like it wanted it to. There you go. Yeah, nothing. Maybe he's just all distraught about his cave getting torn up. He's being all emo about it. Yeah, I mean, who can blame him? Um. Most most people are not that possessive about a cape. They Though, oddly be. enough, Antonio Banderas is. I believe it. Like, if you haven't seen Antonio Banderas in a lot of stuff, he's actually been doing, like, a very specific clothing line for capes. Dude so, loves capes. You talked about this before. It's great. Mr. Freeze is not in this game. Yes, but there's his room. Yeah, right here. So you don't see him, patience. but it's pretty sweet. You're cheating. Yeah. How am I cheating? That was such an obvious one, asshole. Here I don't like this fight. Excellent. Oh? Why not? I'll leave it to you then, my dear. I've had to do it many times. Though, I think mostly I had to do it many times on, like, hard mode. Because there are three different levels, each of which can just start being electrified on the floor. Oh, that's annoying. Yeah. God damn it.
which is useful sometimes when I just want to leave the guys there. Is there at least a little bit of like a buildup so we know? Hey. Yeah. So oh, okay, there you go. God damn it! Oh, he missed. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, fried bat wings. Yeah. And also, these motherfuckers with the shock sticks. That sounds incredibly annoying. Also, shock sticks. You want some? That seems like it was stolen from Demolition Man and the three seashells and all that. Three seashells, yeah. Sure. It's amazing how many people get that quote, but they don't know that it's actually from. Oh, he just barely got out of there. Knock him back into it. Uh. I could have done that. Nice. Oh! Oh, that... That fucking sucks with the shock stick. Fuck that. Yeah, I gotta jump over him and then fuck him up on this side. Gotta... Don't like this fight. Why can't you use the shock sticks? That's not lethal. Uh... Can in like Arkham Origins, but like who wants to play that game? That's a fair point. <laughs> and everybody's just like, I right. should have gone to the other side and pulled him over with my fucking grapple. I'm yeah. a fool. A foolish fool. A fully justified fool. If only we were half okay. as great as Future Rock, we could come up with our own quotes. Yeah. But we're not, we still there. Exactly. Stealing from the greats is just how you're supposed to do. Yeah, that's how you learn. Oh, I'm on I made my it. way now. Oops, change of plans, kiddo. But I tried my best. Sorry, but there is no prize for second place. I'm afraid you're off the party list. Better luck next time. <laughs> no. <laughs> the fuck? Don't you fucked up. Is all that necessary, Harley? Yeah. <laughs> Just fuck her up. Hey, hands up the merchandise. That's my party list. Quiet. Why the smiles next to certain names? You're the detective, you tell me. Because that's going to work. Yeah. Get in. Yeah. You won't find Mr. J. He's in the secret lab in the gardens and oh crap. Yep, I know. Damn. Well he'll get me out, you'll see. Yeah. You'll see. So I could just like hang out here and just talk to her for a while. Oh that's nice. Subdued, and I have a print scanned. So you can find the secret lab in the gardens. Yes, Harley's been everywhere on the <laughs> island, so I'm calibrating the scanner to only show prints that have traces of chlorophyll. Stop okay, talking on the phone. Be careful. I rerouted a Wayne Tech satellite to show thermal scans of the island. <laughs> the gardens are showing up hot. Something bad is happening there. there you we... can talk to her and also do other things. No, he can't. He's Batman. Yeah, attack the gardens, great. Oh, I'm supposed to go in here and open them, huh? Sometimes I just get lost, like, looking at all the little design things, like, especially with the cape. Yeah, the cape is just so good. They spent a lot of time on that. Yes. Take this map. So, you have given in and taken my map. I hope it proves useful. It will. Yeah, it's gonna be great. Look at all those bodies. More ass. Patients may hey. speak their size. For the record, the patient has transferred from Dr. Cassidy, who is on leave after the incident last week. Hello, Victor. Please take a seat. Guards, you can leave us. Sorry, Doctor. Warden's orders. I can't leave you alone with him. I understand. Hello, Victor. How are you feeling today? Victor, I can't help you if you don't speak. Depressed. Does that help you? Can you get into my mind, Doctor? Why depressed? I'm just thinking about the one that got away. The one I chose. I need the mark. I want the mark! 
Okay. Uh, he's a little crazy. If you didn't, yeah. if you didn't know that, just a bit. He uh, he might he might need some drugs. Yeah. Like me too, but also you know for different reasons. Yes, we all know you need drugs. <laughs> I just need alcohol. I'm a traditionalist. Yes. Okay. So, I don't think that I can do Mr. Freeze's one. Mm -hmm. Or any of these other ones. No, okay. Okay. I can only open the one. The one, the one. Don't go for the one. Yeah. All these damn Riddler trophies, they're freaking everywhere. Oh no, I got locked in. Oh no. Pull it, your beretta. I pull out my beretta. Hey, bro. You can stop that. <laughs> How much you hate that guy is just funny to me. It's really boring. Batman. How about we do it here? No. Batman does things his own way. Magic. I shoot the whoop. I shoot the whoop. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's too bad. Uh, Mr. Freeze, though, has one of the coolest fucking fights in Arkham City. People talk about it all the time for being masterful game design. Oh? So that's pretty sweet. Oh, that's nice. Like, you have to fight him using several different techniques. Once you use one thing on him, it won't work again. Oh, nice. Because he, he adapts to everything. It's pretty sweet. That That's really cool. Um, But yeah, I feel like we should probably call it here. Oh, uh, okay. We're at about 30 minutes. Just a little bit shy. Yeah. But it'll be about 30 after we do our shout-outs. Yes. All right. So, uh, I guess I'll go ahead and lead. Okay. Okay, so this one was a cartoon way back when I was a kid, and it has still been echoing throughout uh, everything, because it was just, holy shit, great. And the more you watch it, the better it gets, and the more you grow up, the creepier it gets. Yeah. So, my shout-out is to Courage the Cowardly Dog Show. Yeah. That was a great fucking show. It was never my favorite. I don't think it was ever my favorite either. Yeah. But I can still watch it today just fine. Sure. Especially some of the ones like, you know, Return, Return the Slab will suffer my curse. Right. Or uh, Freaky Frey that's like, you have been naughty. And yeah, that one's like, weird. Right? It's fucking great. And Bathtub Barracuda and all yeah. that. They are great. And then the one where Muriel gets turned into a kid. It's like, more cheese! More macaroni. I don't like macaroni and cheese. And then she tosses it. I'm like, that is what having kids is like. Yeah. And that's why I don't ever want kids. <laughs> snip, snip. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a it's a great fucking show, and I miss it. And they're doing, like, this started popping up on my YouTube feed recently. Just the uh, live stream of it. Yeah. Just the whole series. Live streams. It's pretty yeah. sweet. So I've been watching that a lot when I'm just, like, doing other shit. Checks out. So it works out. So, yeah, if you don't. If you are not familiar with that show, go watch it. There are a few, like, missed episodes. You're just kind of like, okay, what the fuck was that? But that's okay. Because the ones that are great, nail it perfectly. Yeah. You can tell that they were doing some kind of weird drugs. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, as for me, I'm going to do a <laughs> shout-out to a YouTube channel called 10 Second Songs. Oh, I forgot about them. Yeah. Uh, They're great. This guy is an incredible, like, impressionist. Um, but he does singing and he just does like a, one song in like 10 different styles. So he'll start off with like, so he did uh smells like teen spirit recently. Yep. He start off doing the Nirvana and he does a great fucking Kurt Cobain impression when he's singing. And then he swaps to some other band. Like, I don't remember who it was, but like smash mouth, okay. smash mouth and then like Evanescence and then sure. whatever. And it just goes, and he's excellent at it. I can't get over how good he is at this. And every um, now and again, he'll uh, he'll push himself a little bit farther. He did like fifty versions of Rap God or something. Like yeah, that. he some, did some crazy high number. It was and they awesome. were all great. Yeah. So, yeah, if you haven't heard of him or checked him out yet, go do that. Ten second songs, dude is talent. Yeah, very very talented. But, all right, guys, we will catch you next time. Thanks so much, guys. Bye. Bye.